has been here. Just make out the Lando Coliseum in the distance. Right, we can't teleport out, so we're stuck here. Crumbling Farum Azula. I'll try and remember that. Now we can just make out the Colosseum over here, I think. That's a long way away. Maybe that was a forge. I don't know. I don't know where the hell I am. What even is this place? Prehistoric dragons? The land of old? Somewhere that was removed from the lands between? Also, the last time I was here, I tried fighting the guys and it ended very, very poorly. Is this going to end the same way? Okay, so just beyond there, I can see the continents, if we could even call it that. The mountaintops of the giants. Why is it telling me to go this way? I don't know. The tornadoes don't look great, but just the general imagery of this place. It's on par with everything that I've seen in Elden Ring so far. It just looks spectacular. Alright. What am I in for? Okay, I can kill these guys at least. That's good. I'll have to go back to the four belfries when I can and use the alternate entrance. See what that has to offer me. Why are we even here? We set the Earth Tree of Flame and we find ourselves here. Teleported. Yet there are trees down there. Is this going to let us teleport out though? You there, Melina? She's not there. Yes, at this point we can teleport out. I mean, I don't want to, but we can totally teleport out if we wanted to. Crumbling Beast Grave. Wanted to see how many runes I had. I know I don't have enough, but... Almost 10,000. Okay. Summoning Pool. That's concerning. If we go up there, we can summon ashes. We can summon ashes here too. Boss battle? This kind of looks like a boss battle area. Picked it like a dirty nose. 
Uh, might not be a boss battle, actually. It might just be a random dragon. Holy shit. Uh... Alright. Clearly I need to take a look at that lightning-proof liver that I just picked up. Holy shit. Holy shit. Uh, dive or... I can't tell. I can't see shit. Can't lock on shit. He's throwing fire and lightning at me. This is awful. One or two more hits there. Oh god. Please. God damn it. So close to first attempt. By so close, I mean I was down to about three quarters. Um, I don't know if I want to switch my armor here. I'll switch back to the Crucible set, but I don't know if I want to switch to a dedicated lightning set or a lightning shield because he is still throwing fire at me. Let's go back to the Crucible set, because that has much better stats on pretty much everything. And you know, I'm still at medium load. I guess there's no time like the present though, is there? Might as well try one of those out, see how it goes. And my Mimic Tier can employ that as well. Five hundred points per hit. Oh, shit. Ah, uh, no, we're okay. Either I just got lucky there, or that um, Dragon Rot or Dragon Wound Grease actually works. I'm inclined to think it's a combination of both, because he didn't really use any attacks that I got caught in, and I was doing about 500 damage per hit. The moving tier was doing similarly, so yeah, it didn't last very long. God, I really don't know what I would be doing right now if I didn't have the Mimic Tear with me. I'd probably have to be looking online for help. It's 
Side of Grace. We're at the Crumbling Beast's Grave. Where are we now? Crumbling Beast Grave Depths. Have we really proceeded though? And is this guy going to respawn? No, he's not, because he dropped a um, he dropped a very good item. Sorry, I'm just got the hiccups. Uh, so it looks like we're spiraling around here into this into this city. Get down there. Things look so peaceful. Yeah, see so if we can jump up there. Um, I'm not going to yet, however. Oh god, so many choices. That's an elevator directly ahead. Surprise I didn't smash. is outside. Nothing down there. Uh, maybe. No, okay. Unless there's something cunningly built into the side as it's going down, in which case the game can have it. things. Oh, worm faces. What are they doing? Ah, uh, you know what? I shouldn't ask questions. I should just play. Whoa! I genuinely thought I was out of range. So we've got two ways we can go, right, down a bunch of platforms, or left, past a bunch of worm faces. I think I'll try going right.
less enemies this way. Okay, that seems to be how we get back around. Can't summon torrents here, just confirm. Yep, okay. Let's take out the first guy at least without dying. Less than 2,000 runes. That's telling me if I want to grind anywhere, which I don't think is necessary because I'll have a rant about that at the end of the game. Um, I would be doing so at the Hadlick Tree. Oh god. Terrible jump. Apologies, everyone. Okay, let's try that again, shall we? Better. Better. Much better. Is this a boss battle? Uh, short answer is no, because we can't summon our Ash, but it's a battle. Similar kind of dragon. It has that uh, wave attack, I'll call it. This one doesn't appear to be as chonky as the other. Although it is going to breathe fire or something in a moment. See what it's doing. It's fine. It's nearly down. One more hit will do it. So I do note that these ones are not giving me dragon hearts. Unlike virtually all the other dragons that I've killed throughout the game. There it is. That's the Giant's Forge. Somewhere over there is the capital city. You can make out the Divine Tower on the back of the Earth Tree there. That is the Isolated Tower. That is the Sanctum. That, I assume, is the Kaelid Tower. Hell, it might even be Limgrave. I don't know. Either way, I think it's a beautiful world. Alright, now that I'm here, now I was. I just killed that guy for... 30,000 runes, and honestly, not much else. A plus 8 smithing stone. I don't feel that was worth it. Alright, we need to go check out those worm faces. God. Jumping puzzles. Interrupt this guy with um, R2 or R1. I haven't tried to charge R2, but I don't like my odds. I 
about a charge. Okay, a charge upsets him. That's good. We have a ladder going up there. Sort of shrine thing on the far right. That path just lets me skip a lot of those dudes, by the looks of it. That's not fatal. So I'm just exploring this church here, just this outer side. Please be something nice. Please be something worth coming here. Please. Uh, that's far from ideal. That's probably death. the R2s, but not really getting anything off there. Um, I'm thinking of... Oh, I have Gravelstone. Wow. It'd be great if I knew what they did. Let me swap that particular talisman with this. It might give me an additional second or two to roll out of the way of their attacks. Nothing down here. No. Good. I'm guessing this area is entirely optional. Let's try some of those, because why the hell not? I mean, it needs to be closer. He's poisoned. Seems like a lot of darts to actually get the poison effect off, though, which won't last terribly long. But really, all I wanted to do was pull him. There we go. Okay, he's up. We can summon the Mimic Tear. I'm going to do so. And hopefully it won't immediately go down to death. The effect that is not uh, zero HP. This is another worm face spinny boss. Heal, heal, heal. Oh shit. Spewing shit everywhere. Oh no. Once again, I can't believe I'm not dead. Kill it, Mimic Tear. Do your work. Do your thing. Oh shit. Right, so what was my reward for that? V 
This had better be something nice. It is in certain circumstances, but honestly, I have the crafting materials I need for that. Good to have, though. And it's good to see at this point in the game that uh, Round Table Hold is not entirely forgotten. We need to take that back there and cash it in. Now, the ladder is ahead of me, so I need to take out that guy. And then we'll see what's up there. Ah, see, we need to use that path to get down there in the first place. Got us. There's also maybe a path directly ahead of us, which... Maybe we need to check out. No. Just a little cave. Hey, dude. How you doing? I was just talking about you. Specifically that you need to die. Like so. Do you want to grab that item, but not just yes. Because I think at this point, it's just making our way past those three, and that will take us back to where we were. Shikatima, how are you doing? Thank you for hanging out, and I hope you're having a great day. See if we can get the charge attack off. Nice. Just another decent crafting resource. Yeah, I want to grab that item down by the tree. And then get out of here. And by get out of here, I mean I'll probably try and teleport out if I'm not in combat. Okay, let's grab that. I need more of those. Alright, I can't get out, so... It's very hard to see if this thing's actually here. Alright. Let me teleport back there so that I get my flasks back and we'll continue on. So, two ways to go. Check out the church or check out above here. I'll check out above here first. Anything nice? Uh, disappointingly, it looks like the answer's no, unless maybe there's something in those windows. Yes, okay. Something up at the very top of the church. like a legendary quality item right there. Oh. Alright. You're not doing that again. What is this? Ah, uh, there are a dime dozen now, those aren't they? So I could potentially drop somewhere here, but... 
I don't feel it would be safe to do so unless maybe I'm dropping down on that bridge there. I'm sure we've been on that bridge already. Yeah, we have. I've I recall taking that guy out. Alright. This is still be Legends, man. I feel like this time it's time to head out here and then start heading around into the city proper. Shit, it's another one of these. Ah, shit. Ah, shit. And that's for some incantations or something. Yeah, Shaggy, thank you for hanging out, dude. Really appreciate it. Don't know if I'll get this done tonight, but we'll see how we go. Contains red lightning incantations. We need to give that to a cleric. Side of grace. Tempest facing balcony. And that's what this is called, a tempest. Looks like a tornado to me. It's so strange that I see trees here. And perhaps this place is still actually populated. Oh! What on earth does... Okay, never mind. I thought it was going to be a plus 9 or a plus 10. Um, we can go down there. Two ways by the looks of it. Oh fuck, how large is this dungeon? Pretty large by the looks. Uh, we can maybe go... No, I can't go up there. I've not forgotten about the four belfries. A bit too chonky to fit through that gap. Is this where? No, it was further away. Ah, oh, shit. I'm trying to see if I can find where I fell down from uh, the four belfries. I suspect I may need to go back there, however, to find the exact spot. It's not good. Okay, that one's down. Multiple down. That's fine. I can work with that. Hmm. 
And yet, that window there looks like I should be able to go through it. I don't think I can, though. No. Ah, game. That's me trolling myself at this point. Okay, so we can either go... Can we go up there? It looks like we should be able to get across there somehow, or maybe we need to come back that way. God, this is so dangerous for very little benefit. Yeah, okay, I think we need to enter the lower level there. I see you sniping at me there, dude. Alright, we're not going back up. Whoa. Are you undead? Yes, you are. Definitely do not want you getting back up. Who is shooting at me? Alright, you are a problem. You might have to stay alive a bit longer than I want you to stay alive. That is probably a safe drop. Let me hit that side of grace first. Plus nine. This is going to cause them to respawn, but it's fine. I can make that jump back there, that's fine. I might not be able to make this jump, though. Nice. Can I make that jump down there? That's probably pushing us, but I think it's doable. I've only got 120,000 runes and I can teleport back here if it goes wrong. No, that's fine. Okay. Could maybe go even further down, but that would be pushing it. Wrong side. Fifty fifty chance, and I screwed it up. So, I assume that was the hole that I saw earlier. So if I fall down here, there must be a way back up. Like this way, for example, which is most likely going to take me to an archer.
Come here, you. God damn it. That's the worst possible thing that could have happened. Alright. What was that night of? Another one of these which we don't need, and... Oh, I saw you there. So from here at this point, we would go this way. Then back down to the corridor where we were earlier. And I actually do need to jump down because I'm still in combat somehow. Okay, let's go have a snooze. And we'll plan our next step. Uh, 40,400. I know I've got enough. I'm still thinking about Melania's sword. Speaking of which, I need to check out to see what the Fire Giant Remembrance does. And I also need to start duplicating some remembrances and cashing them in. I've just been holding off because I don't know what's required for the plat. Gave me some terrible flashbacks just then. Uh, what is this armor like? We've seen the Banished Knight's helm. That's actually not bad. I'll take that. What about the helm? I'll take that as well. I've got the space for it, I may as well. And this is suddenly making me realise that I need to have a look at the lore. So last time I looked at this was in Stormvale Castle. Forced to abandon their homes. No, that's nothing. I thought it might be the knights that came from this place and or were exiled here. Okay, you drew your sword. Are you going to come at me, bro? Oh, wow. I should be dead. Somehow I'm not. It's just handing me the full set. Yeah? Diarrhea Enjoyer, lovely name. Is this a strength build? It's a sword and board build, yeah. Strength and dex. Very, very boring, unfortunately. I think when I replay this on the PS5, I may try for a magic build. Uh, 
choices. those. There we go. Okay, last major boss killed was Fire Giants, and before that it was Melania. You ask me how many attempts it took, um, I think you'll be very sad. Just an annoying boss. Yeah, she um, was annoying the first two times I fought her, but then the third time she went down nice and easy. I think I lucked into the correct... Oh god. I lucked into the correct build to take her down very, very easily, which is Mimic Tear and Bleed. Oh, that combo. are rapidly burning through my flasks. Uh, where am I going? I could have gone down from upstairs, but... Okay, that would have led me here. It's probably a good thing that I didn't jump. Here. Yeah, at this point I don't know what I'm going to come up against here. I really don't. I feel like I should be able to go down there already, but I haven't seen a path. Oh, wow. Okay. Is this a boss battle? It totally is. Oh, shit. That is a problem. That is a huge problem. I don't think we're surviving this. Not with the amount of blasts that I don't have. The thin one at least doesn't have a lot of HP, so that is a promising sign. Oh shit, we're all the way back here. No stake, okay. How do we get back? Oh, nasty. 
I didn't know you could do fire damage like that. Just excuse me for a moment while I reset you. Dragon Temple. Oh, we can just go straight through here to get there. Okay. Very well. No, maybe not. Excuse me, fellas. I know I can get there down here. I think. I hope. I hope I'm not missing anything by not summoning him. And I'm doing this in the wrong order, but it's fine. Alright, come here, you. Quite enough stamina to work my way through that. Ooh, not, not good, not good, not good. That's a hook. No, not the hook. That's the explosion. Ah. These mix ups. Okay, I need to stay away from that. I think we're looking okay though. If I can just get this one down. Might have half a chance. I got it down. Yeah, this one's doable, it's just annoying. Don't know how many runes I lost there, but it's totally fine. I'll lose plenty more before the game is over, I'm sure. Everyone hates this boss, but I quite like the challenge. Uh, I hate the fat dude. Don't know what his name, proper name is. But the fat dude, just fighting him alone is a huge pain in the ass. Oh, wow. I'm kind of occupied here. This is not the man to fight. If I can use some mimics here just to distract the other dude. Go ham on this one. Yeah, that rolling attack is ridiculous. Oops, that's okay. I think. Nice. That bleed. That bleed again. Wait. There's more. It's not over. What have we got? Just another noble, or whatever it's called. I think it's a noble. Oh shit. Well then. I hate it when that happens. Um, I picked up a ball bearing and some sort of incantation, I believe. I really actually hate it when that happens. Really, actually, completely, totally. God damn it. Ruin fragments? Cool. Um, something, something, tornado. I saw the word tornado there. Don't know, don't care, because I'll never be able to use it. Yeah, the Mimic with Bleed um, allowed me to pretty much tear through Melania. Okay, this is opened up now. How many runes did that drop?
I do wonder if I needed to summon Bernal for a volcano mana quest line or whatever. Just grab those. 170,000. Yeah. I need 1,000 and a bit. Just see six of those. It almost seems like this game is kind of designed to um, use the summons. Watching you kill that in three tries hurts a little. It took me probably 20 to 30 times. I'm also a little bit overleveled, I think. I don't feel like I've been grinding anywhere. I've just been exploring a lot, but... Melania took me three goes, so I think that will hurt a lot of people. Yeah, that almost uh, made me think of the Four Kings fight from Deep. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, the Four Kings fight from Demon Souls, where they just keep spawning and spawning and spawning. Oh, okay, so there's possibly a path we can just jump over here and then get to the boss battle from here. Interesting. This, I guess, is the way forward, so... Yeah, nah. Let me explore the rest of the temple first. God's King Duo reminds me of Ornstein and Smo. Yeah, I think the first time I saw that um, noble, or whatever it is, the fat dude, I thought, yeah, that's Smo. It was like at a distance. God damn, dude. And then I get killed by some random soldier here. The fat dude, certainly. The skinny dude, I feel, is missing the spear. Like, the spear is so much of Ornstein's identity. The way I can just teleport around the room and just slam that thing into you. How do we get down to that other item? Pretty much directly ahead of me and down. Come on. Oh, come on, I'll block that. I mean, technically, I blocked that as well, but not for very long. Alright, let me spawn at the previous points. Get my runes back, and I'll just see if I can find a way down to that item, but if not, I shall move on. Alright, so the runes hopefully are just ahead of me. Another item down there as well. I shouldn't be looking that way. I should be worrying about this guy. Should be just over to my left, I think. God damn.
Alright, if I don't see... There we go. That's the last one. Is that going to put me up to heavy? It is not. Alright. I'll give that a miss for now and maybe come back here later. Let's just teleport down there and continue on. So, we've got... ...the long way around or the short way around. Well, you know, maybe they both lead to exactly the same area. Yeah, I've definitely fought you before. I don't remember which cave it was, but I fought you and one of your mates. keep asking this, but what even is this place? Why is it floating in the middle of nowhere? Why is it ruined? Why was a beast man from this place in the very first cave that we walk into heading to Stormvale Castle? So I don't recall seeing anything in the item descriptions or the lore saying what this place is or why it's been removed from the world. From a standard gameplay perspective, if I hadn't opened the uh, shit, if I hadn't opened the um, gates at the four belfries, this would be the first we've seen of it. And we literally got here after we set the earth tree on fire. Uh, I'm not going that way. You look chonkier than the other beastmen, but you are not. Is this the... It's not, is it? Yes, it is. Never mind. That's the thing that I saw before. It's not expecting that. just came from so I can go up here which I think leads back towards the palace area ah shit uh, I was not expecting it to lead back there wait I was just here wasn't I was I just here no I was further down okay I feel obligated to try that jump. Just came from down there. There's nothing around here. Let's take care of you. Or not. Holy shit. 
just one out in the middle of nowhere there. I don't know if I can reach that. Not from this side. Can I reach you from over here? Yes, I can. What is in here? How many keys? Two. And that brings me down to about eight or seven. Oh shit. I don't think we've ever had a stone sword key lead us to a side of grace like that. The dragon temple lift. Oh fuck. I'll explore, but I do wonder if that's actually a significant shortcut. I don't think it is though, because I believe our goal is to head over here, rotating around, but we're now just on the top of the temple, by the looks. Please don't just be a ghost... Oh, God. A ghost ward or whatever. Uh, he's getting back up. One down. Two down. You're out there, buddy. All right, you need to go down. Don't have a choice. Playing the giant oversized bird bath here. Alright, what have we got? Worth it. 50,000 runes. Worth it. Is it worth two stone saw keys? Uh, I mean, we're not done with this area yet, so I'm not sure. Oh god. What's hitting me? Oh no you don't. Oi. Yeah, I probably should just go around, shouldn't I? See you later, fellas. Ah, oh, shit. 
was not expecting them to follow, and if I expected that, then I would have been able to ambush them a bit more easily down here. What about the other two? Hey, you. Alright, let me go around now. Another golden seed, which we don't need. So really, if this is actually the only way of getting to this area, then those two keys are actually worth it. still in combat, but I really wanted to look at the map just so I could see where this boss battle is. We can summon here though, which is... Uh, it's concerning. I really don't know if this is the end game area, there's anything after this or what. But I assume our goal is to go back to the Earth Tree back in Langdor. One's well hidden, yeah. I know I'm gonna miss stuff. I'm playing blind, so it's all good. Uh oh, okay. Might as well drink that. Do you have a name? You do not. I see you. I assume that's a dive bomb. Uh, did you just reset? No, you're just hanging out up there. This is upsetting on many levels. I can't grab its loose. You've never seen that, that happen before? Yeah, I've never seen that happen before either, Diary and Joy. It's almost like he went out of bounds. And the problem is, I don't know if that's a really decent item or not, but I can't grab that. More Z-axis shenanigans. What I might do very quickly is go back to the elevator, run here, see if I can grab that. If not, then sadly I think we have to move on. Is that Alexander? Oh, this takes me back up here. Okay. I was wondering about this path. Let's, uh, are we done here? There's nothing at the Dragon Temple that we can see. I see a few enemies below us, but they can wait. No, I can't go in there. Let me just clear out the area below me. Let me respawn and see if we can potentially grab that item. Can't mount torrents here. We'll just run this way. I could maybe go down there as well to the rice. 
which may take me back down into the temple, but I don't think that's a good idea. If they don't drop uniques, then I'll move on. But all I want to see is whether that item persists. Okay, the dragons respawned, and yeah, okay. Let me take this path, which takes us back to the beast ruins. Is that Alexander? It totally is. Ah, I see you finally made it here yourself. The city hanging in the air is slowly crumbling. What an incredible place we find ourselves. But that aside, I can't believe you felled that giant. It was practically a god. I doubt there's another soul out there who could have done the same. Of course, I count myself the great Alexander among many. Which means I've but one thing to ask of you. Would you kindly undertake my ordeal? Come and tell me when you're ready. I've been longing to fight a warrior as accomplished as you. We get to murder him. Uh, I'll undertake your ordeal as soon as I've explored this path. Uh, yes, we've been up that ladder. The way he described the city just now, it's that it was enchanted to hang in the air, and it's slowly crumbling. That is... I mean, we're not going back this way. That's fine. I can just teleport back. Anything up here? It's the inside of this area that we couldn't access before. I see you there, dude. And I don't want you interrupting me. Something nice, I hope. Uh, probably something really nice if I engage with the crafting systems. Come on. Nice. You're not surviving another one. Anything else? From here, I believe I would have to drop down there. And now we're on a very, very long loop back. Is that going to kill me? No, good. Alright, let me just clear out the area. And then we'll teleport. Hopefully without dying, because I really don't want to come back here to grab my runes. Oh. Not good, not good. I kind of don't want to lose 76,000 runes, so let me teleport and grab those. Where are they? Do 
directly ahead. Okay, let's go have a chat to Alexander. And then after that, I think we'll go back down the lift and continue exploring. Ready then, I take it. Then let us begin. I am the great jar warrior. I am this Alexander. Lend me strength. Let us become one champion together. are destined to one day break but the great alexander lived as a warrior to his last <laughs> oh that was incredibly depressing uh a talisman and a key item yeah i really shouldn't have got hit there i'm just being lazy Greatly boosts the attack power of skills. Scraps of stewed flesh cling to the shard. Ugh. And tatters of ornaments can be can be seen mingled with, within the slime. I can't read. Relics of a red-haired champion, it would seem. Who else do we know with red hair? You wouldn't happen to be related to Radagon, would you? Um, where is it? Found at the core of the dead flesh that once filled the great jar. The jars contain dregs inherited from those who came before. Thus our warriors passed from jar to jar, carrying dreams of greatness. Yeah, I really don't know what we're supposed to do with most of this stuff. Alright, I think we're done in this little section here. So let's teleport back to the lift. We'll go down and move on. Uh, not that way. The opposite of that way. Uh, there's nothing down here, cunningly hidden. Uh, yes, there is, but it's called Swift Death. So I mentioned earlier that this jump is asking for it. So let's go this way. This is taking me near to where I was before though. Another high class item here. Just get the little dude down first. Oh no, not good, not good, not good. Two on one is just not fair. That's from Jesus. All of my skills have abandoned me. I didn't have many to begin with. All right, come here, you. Let's 
stay down. Ah, is that going to lead me to the uh, temple, whatchamacallit? Maybe not. Uh, I think I've been down there. More importantly though, what is this? Nice. Still haven't used one of those yet. Alright, can we get back without dying? I mean, we should be able to. Unless I jump too far here. Good. Alright. I got down here and then I got distracted. Where were we going? I think I came from that way, didn't I? We're going this way. Have I? No. For a moment there, it looked like I was approaching the Dragon Temple again, and this is probably incredibly dangerous, but it's fine. Alright. What's in store for me here? Base man. Straight or go right. Right is going to lead us up. I think that's where I need to go next because we're getting attacked. going to take us back to towards where we just were, but I think this is a dead end. This is a shortcut leading back to where we were. I'm probably missing something significant there, but it is what it is. Could maybe drop down there, but that seems dangerous. Nothing else up here. Okay. Is that not where we just came from? It totally is. There's nothing over there. I'm not taking a leap game. This might be a boss battle arena. Crucible nice. It's been a while since I've fought one of you without the Crucible Knight armor on. Oh, not good, not good. Shit, I thought I was out of range. Jesus! Alright, note to self, I have to be careful around these guys. Might as well.
Uh, not that way. I don't know where I'm going. I'm lost. Let's go down the stairs and then through the gateway. Or I drop. Come here, you. Dude. Only I get to swing my sword around like that. Shit. <laughs> Nearly screwed up there. Um, yeah, if I hadn't unlocked that lift and the side of grace on top of it, that would actually be a fairly serious run to get back here. Just take out this guy. At least two, rather. There's maybe an argument to be made for switching back to the katana here, just for the speed. But it's going to do so little damage compared to what I'm using. Look at that. Stamina break off that. My word. Okay, so turning right, and then straight. Right, straight, and then hug the left wall. Those two shouldn't interrupt me, famous last words. Alright, let's uh, give Barricade Shield a go. Uh, not dual handing it though. Don't need that. Not getting an interrupt off him, but, or not stunning him, but. This is not consuming all of my stamina just for one damn block. Jesus Christ, this guy had better not respawn. Alright, let me just rest for a moment. That did virtually nothing. Jesus. Now it's going to be a break. And now I'm probably dead. Holy fuck. This guy is giving zero fucks. Holy shit. And that's before he even gets his angel wings and goes into phase two. Okay, that's a problem. I might just be able to run past him, but I kind of want to take him out. Send this back up. Right. And then straight. Hopefully this dude won't stab me with his spear. He's just going to follow me menacingly. It's curious that I'm only starting to lose stamina now, and even that is very short-lived. Game didn't consider me in combat. Alright. Runes are there, let's drink that. Give this another go. Look at 
voice through most of the attacks, but apparently not. Okay, one more for a break. Please don't kill me now. Stop the heal first and see what you do. Okay, that's a... Not what I thought it was. If you had a... Whoa! If you had a spear, this would be easy. Holy shit! Alright, please just go down. And don't get back up. The worst part is that was only worth 7,360 runes. Holy shit. That fire attack, though. Looked like he had gills for a moment. Well, not gills, but you know that... You know that thing that puffer fish have? Oh, shut up. Uh... Yeah, okay. I say that when I see that up there, and I should have gone for that first, but having said that, I would not be able to get here if I'd grabbed that first. But also having said that, that was not worth it. Eh, not really. <laughs> 